Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with Graveyard Keeper. And I learned something new from uh, a subscriber that uh, is in my uh, Discord channel. He, his name's uh, Yezarul, hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. And he told me that you can put zombies on these stations like this. Now, I knew you could put them on, you could build custom stations for them, kind of like the one down here that this one's at. This is a special zombie growing station that looks like, let's just see under here, the zombie farm here. But I didn't know you could just stick them pretty much anywhere that you'd normally do work. So this guy's here, here's just making boards. We could put them, let's say we needed, I don't know, some nails. We could put them on the anvil and then tell him to make nails. Whoa, that's probably too many nails, but whatever. We'll just get him to sit there and it's pretty awesome. The only downside is is that you don't get the experience points like the green and red or blue skill points uh, when they do their the work for you. That's kind of okay though at this point because I have quite a few red and green stored up and I can get blue points from doing a few other things like polished stone for instance. That gets us some blue points. Uh, that gave us one. Also, uh, making hemp rope does it. Oh, I see my vineyard needs picking here. Uh, it's actually Sunday now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go do my service, my sermon, or whatever. After I make some polished stone here, I put a bit more storage down. Kind of add energy. Just eat some honey. I've been trying to organize inventory a little bit. So glass and metal goes there. Uh, exotic metals go there. Stone goes here. Stone-like things. I'm going to bring these statues or these tombstones over. I'm going to bring these logs as well. I've been trying to keep my inventory pretty clean though. I only grab what I need, except things keep flying into my inventory like that, which I don't like. Uh, especially with that. I don't need that. I have been improving the the graveyard a bit. I buried a few more bodies. And I made quite a few zombies. So there's zombies up in the quarry. There's zombies making food. And I'll show you the zombies doing alchemy in a sec here. So what do I want to do here? I want to put some headstones on some decent graves. This one has... This one's decent stick one on there so at least it's plus one now uh, what else can we put one on down here this zero one maybe yeah I gotta put some borders around these as well so the graveyards up to 214 at the moment I think there's a quest yeah we can upgrade this thing here have you had any problems with the ink Inquisition, ghosts or witches? <laughs> I've had some problems. We get another. We won't need another ship of the dead. Okay, so we're we're trying to get our inside at fifty. And what are we at right now? Thirty-seven. We're getting close. I put in some of these wall candles here on the sides. Incense burners. I got two confessionals now. So slowly improving things. I want to put the shrine in, but I need the wooden beam for that. And I think I need a sawmill to make those, or I could buy them. Incense burners, I already put those in. What else? Um, soft church bench. I need some fancy jointing and silk for that. Stained glass window. I, I don't have gold yet, so can't do that. So I'm not sure what else I can do. I'm gonna get some candles just before I do the service here. I guess if we get enough silk, we could get more out of these benches. But I'm gonna light some candles so I get a little bit more during this service. I'm gonna light them all on fire, why not? It's probably a waste because my church isn't that good, but let's put some candles in here. That'll give us a little boost. Two over here. 
I can actually use this. Hello. Okay. Maybe not. Oh. It's hidden. It's hidden behind the back. And I'll do this double one here. Okay, so that adds plus six. I'm stuck. <laughs> okay, there we go. 43. Time to do a service. I want to get the better version of the combo pair, so I might be doing that this episode. There's like a bronze, silver, and gold version. So I'm going to try to do that. Getting a pretty good amount of faith during these services now. So it looks like I got 13. Yeah. And donations are pretty good now. So the donation money is based on the graveyard rating and the faith is based on that internal uh, church rating. And I've been using my faith kind of as I get it to make more zombies, but I'm probably okay for zombies now. Let me just make sure there's no more wall candle spots here. I don't have the materials because I put them all away because you guys put, told me to put my stuff away. I always carry this kind of stuff around because I always want to build it. But it's pretty easy to go grab. So in here, what have I added? More storage, and I've added these two zombie stations. So this one's a zombie alchemy decomposer. So I'll get I'll get uh, this zombie working on breaking down some carrots. And they're pretty fast. And these zombies aren't very good quality. And then down here we got a zombie alchemy workbench. So they can actually make potions here. And what should I make? I had them making energy potions before. Growth enhancer. Let's make some energy elixir. Actually, growth enhancer. Oops. Clear that off. We can do a bit of mix of both, I guess. Oh, no, we can't. Or maybe we can, but I clicked out too early. So I need some more blue points. I'm going to open up some technology stuff here. I really want playwright. Because I'm going to be doing lots of story stuff, but I'm not sure I want to do it just yet. Um, I keep going to the same one. Okay. I kind of want to do more uh, of this stuff. Sorry, graveyard stuff. Because then I can research these things and get blue points for them. So kind of pay back the money I'm using on them. So I'm going to go to go and try to make some of these things. The monuments are probably really expensive, so probably won't be able to do those just yet. What else can we get here? Um, ooh, strong alcohol. That could be nice. I do want to unlock the third furnace, which is down here, blueprint furnace three. So I think I might do this one see what the third furnace can do for us and what was the other thing rule of this lantern network firemen uh, increase your furnace productivity and smelt more per load that sounds pretty good so I'm gonna do that some of these perks are really good so we're down to 36 blue points so I think I'm gonna go grab uh, try to make some of those new new things I did make a, a bronze chapter here, but before I make any more documents and stories and stuff, I'm going to do that playwright because it'll increase our chances of getting better stuff, I think. Let me just double check that. What does playwright do? Um, that's under writing. Playwright. You can actually you find you can write down anything you remember from modern culture. I think this is going to help us in some way. And I haven't tried to do anything on the printing press yet, so I'm probably going to do that. Well, let's grab our money. I've been making a lot of money. I've been selling wine. And we're up to one gold now, which is pretty cool. Which reminds me, I want to get something, uh, this trade license for the merchant. Which I think I can buy here. Somewhere. Oh, we can buy the royal stamp now. Do I want to use my money on that? No, 50 silver. Trade license. 50 silver. Yeah, I'm going to buy that. 
And then when the merchant comes, we're going to try to do that. That's in a couple days. So I'm going to teleport back home. Oh, before I do that, I'm going to drop off some stuff. Oh, I've already got all these burning spots ready to go. And more wood for when we need it. How many carrots do I have in here? 20. I think I've got some bodies I need to burn or bury. Yeah, they've been stacking up. I've been kind of ignoring the donkey. And what about this one here? Oh, this one's rotten. Yeah, I haven't really been doing much with them. Hopefully those two weren't good bodies. Let's just check. Uh, that was four white. I'll just grab some of the stuff out of here. I won't grab everything out of them. Because it takes too long. And it's kind of like an infinite source of body, so I'm not too concerned. But some of them are better than others. Okay, anything else I want out of here? Maybe the meat and the skull. Sorry, I call it meat. It's flesh. The other ones don't stack, so I'm... Not as inclined to get them. Because they just clogged my inventory here. So that's all stored away. I should have stored the story away. Uh, let's go burn this body. Actually, you know what? I'm going to leave it. Because I don't want the donkey to bring any more just yet. And I should have dropped off that story. I'm going to go do that first. guys these guys are so fast even though they're crappy efficiency so I'll just keep making this because this is used in actually I can't remember what this is used in but this down here is used for fertilizer which we're gonna make a lot of he's still busy that's good drop off this story or not let's get the rope out of there where can I stick that rope Inventory so full here. Okay, stick it in there. And really, the prayer, I don't need to be lugging around with me, so we'll go put that out here. The candles don't last very long. Okay, prayer goes in here. Faith, uh, I'll, I will bring it with me because I think I might need some. Okay, let's teleport home. I gotta make eventually some burgers for um, the uh, Inquisitor guy. Okay, these are busy. Store that away. Got so much stuff here, gotta start using it for something. This guy's done. Let's get him back on boards. On board, haha. <laughs> How about this guy down here? I've been growing onions. Pretty nice onions. This guy's idle, so let's get him making... Oops. I've been getting him to do wheat. I don't have any fancy seeds yet, so... And I upgraded it to quality 2 with some quality fertilizer. So both of these gardens are... Rank 2 here. Put our maggots away. And... Fertilizer and seeds, onions. I don't need to be carrying this bread around. Okay, let's use the new, the nice fertilizer, quality fertilizer. And what should I plant? Probably the nice, nice onions. Now, if you plant this regular fertilizer, peat, first, you get. You get this little time symbol and the little quality symbol, both bronze. But then if you put a quality fertilizer on top of it, you get both. But if you just do quality fertilizer, you just get that. So I think if you use maybe boost plus quality, you'll get both silver, but not quite.
quite sure about that. I haven't tried it yet. We'll do these onions, I guess. That's good for now. Okay, it's, uh, oh, we should go talk to the, the gal, Miss, uh, Charm or whatever her name is. What kind of else can I put away here? I'm going to put the food in here, the bread. I made bread for the burgers, which we'll need later. Uh, that's probably good. Okay, I'm going to teleport to town, which I can't. We're going to take the shortcut. I've been making lots of wine as well. In fact, I'm going to grab 20 of these, or maybe six, and try to sell some of it. That should be good. Did I actually get it? Yeah. Now, I was doing a test. I was selling wine one, one at a time. I think copper wine, and it was selling for 76 copper each. And then every time I sold another one, it went down by about one or two copper. And I think it's all based on the amount that they have in their inventory. So I'll just double check that, see if the prices have come back up. Oh, she's here. Oh yeah, I wanted to talk to her. Oh, she bring back the light necklace from Snake. Do I even have the necklace yet? I don't think I do. I don't think I actually have the, the things I need for it yet. So, they're buying red wine copper at 38, so that's based on the number that I've sold them here that's in his inventory. So I'm going to have to wait a while for the price to come back up. Same with the silver wine, it's not selling extremely well right now. I will sell one of them. Looks good. And why did I come here? Oh yeah, to talk to her, but we can't yet. I talked to this guy and I traded wine with him, but after I think 5 silver wine, he said get lost. He stopped giving us stories, so I guess we're pretty much done with him. Can I teleport? Yes. Uh... Oh yeah, I wanted to make some of the new... The new uh, gravestone, so we're going to go home do that. It's one way of getting blue points. I'm also making conical flasks to get blue points. Okay, where do I make those stone things? Here, I think. So this is all new. Stone Grey Fence 2, I think I have made one of those. I will make another one because I know I need it anyway. Might get blue some blue points. Yeah, we got... Ooh, we got quite a few. Uh, what else do I have here? Stone Cross 2, adds 4. Complex iron parts. Yeah, we'll make those. Oh, I should go pick my wine here. I'm gonna drink some wine Oops. to uh, get some more energy here. And this last one, uh, we don't have this carved piece of stone yet. I'm gonna make a few of these stone crosses though. Eat some honey. Okay, that's been researched. That hasn't. Um, I'm going to make a couple of these, a carved piece of stone, because I need, I think, two to upgrade the church fence. So we'll do that. That's going to eat up some of our faith, but I think it'll be worth it. Okay, it's going to be Merchant Day soon. If I was going to rebuild this whole thing, I'd keep these furnaces out of my path, because they... I keep picking the crap up that I don't really want to. Okay, let's go improve the graveyard a bit. Anything else I can drop off? Not yet. Pick some wine. I should probably pick these as well. Maybe I'll just leave it on the ground. I'm using the apples to make like kind of like apple cider, which has been working well. And the berries for kind of berry wine. There's more advanced alcohol we can make though, which I'll be doing at some point. 
Okay, I want to study these before <laughs> before I put them in. Otherwise, I won't be able to study them. So we'll go do that. I've gotten a few confessions over the... when I've been playing offline. Okay, let's try some research here. We're going to do this one. Three faith, okay. How many blue do we get? 30, okay. And we're going to do the other one. Okay, we're over 100. I'm going to do that playwright one now. Get that out of the way. And I think we had... Oh, we can study this as well. Oh, I should have had my grape pie first. Before studying, if you drink grape or if you eat the grape pie, you get you get extra bonuses and stuff. But I forgot to do it. I might do it on this piece of carved stone though. I'm going to I'm going to eat this. So we get that extra study bonus. Oh, 5. Jeez. What a waste of faith in science. I'm going to do it anyway, though. Even though I have so much red science already. Holy moly. That was a lot of red science. Okay. And we got a story out of that. We get more faith next week. So like I said, I want to do the upgraded version of the combo prayer. But I need a book for that. And a book is made out of soft cover... I'm going to try to make some notes here. Now that we have the playwright bonus. Uh, so if we use a gold note, we have a 100% chance of getting a gold... Whatever. Let's do that. There we go. Gold note. What else do we have here? Can I do another one? No. We'll try for a copper here. I mean a silver. Well, we should get it for sure. And I'll put those away. Looks good. Oh, I want to go upgrade this thing outside. I realize I'm sleepy, so I'm going to go up to, to do a little snooze here before we go reach the uh, go see the merchant. Drink some wine. So, which one should I upgrade? This one up here might be good. Five bodies. That's going to add three, so that's worth it. We're up to 217. Now I'm losing my energy here. I guess I'll just run back home because I want to save my teleport for later. I guess I could have taken the shortcut. I'll get that stuff later. Okay, let's sleep for just one short, brief moment. And I'll go put this fruit down here, where it belongs. Apples, berries. Actually, we can do some of this berry juice now. Apple juice. Yum, yum. Oh, we were supposed to make a cure, I think, for the merchant. But I'm going to make some apple ferment here. We'll let that cook away and let's teleport to town. And talk to the merchant. I think he buys wine as well, but maybe only the good stuff. Let's just see. Well, first I'm going to do the trade license. Great, now we're in business. Between my connections and your hard work, we'll be super rich. Okay, we're going to open our first office in here. In a barn. Oh, I got an achievement for that. Put our pallets here. And I'll take crates of goods from here every merchant day. Okay, we're going to have to pack our stuff into crates. Okay. We can sell just about anything. Don't need to pack vegetables. 
cheap labor. Oh, we got zombies for that. Uh, I can sell one crate per week. That's not too much. Okay, we have to increase our fame, I think that is. That'll get us to three crates per week. Okay, so we got some goals here. How can we improve our fame? Advertising flyers. Okay, we can do that. Celebrities. Oh, we can ask Miss Charm. <laughs> we can advertise at the church ceremony. Oh, good idea. Okay. How am I going to transport those crates? They're heavy. Move them along the road. Okay. Storage is connected to the church cellar. Okay, elevator. Wow, this sounds complicated. Okay. Let's talk business. Oh. Trade. Does he want any of our wine? No. I'm going to buy some gold grapes, though. Eight silver. Okay. Yeah, he. I think he buys gold, uh, gold red wine, so... Do that. Uh, we're going to need some more silk at some point, and I think I need... I have a decent amount, so I'll buy a bit more of that. Okay. I think that worked. Yeah. Okay, what do we got here? We can build a pallet, but we need fame first. Okay, we need to bring some flyers back. Uh, trade report. Okay. And yeah, what's this over here? Can I do a crate yet? Oh, that's for extra pallets. I already have one pallet, so... We gotta make a crate somehow. Okay, this was not accessible before, but now it is, so. Looks good. I should probably put these things away. And we'll have to figure out where we put the trade stuff. I don't wanna drop the story off here. And I wanna to try to make a nice book. Where do I do the book covers? Is it here? Oh, flyers. We can do that right now. Okay. Um, let's do that. I'll do... I think he asked for 10. Should I do more? I do have more pen and ink, so I think I'll do that. Drink a bit of my wine for energy. Oh, I'm out of pen and ink. Okay. That's, I think I can make pen and ink over here, but I don't think I have any feathers anymore. Pen and ink. Yeah, I need to buy some feathers. I've got lots of ink. But I can go buy some feathers at the hen place. Oh, and I wanted to do the fence. Let's do that. Hopefully I have everything I need. Actually, what do these silk benches cost? I think I might be able to do it. Sock church bench. Oh no, I need to do the jointing. So I should probably do my furnace three, see what that's all about. But let's try to upgrade here. Stone fence. Oh, I need 24 polished brick. 12 ad complex iron parts. Okay, so I'll go make that, and then we can improve the church a bit. And should I put any crosses in here while I'm here? Ooh, this is a good one. Stone cross too. Let's put that in. That helped quite a bit. Uh, what else can we do? Which grave does not have anything good? This one only has... That's kind of maxed out. I could rip away... This could be max four. Hmm. Maybe I'll save it for a future body. Stash it in there. Stash that in there too. I think I can build from that. Okay, home sweet home. Back we go. 
Actually, I'm gonna put the silk in there. And... Yeah, I'll keep everything else on me. Okay, um... I'm gonna show you that this lentil thing. If you eat lentils, you get like a bonus to sleeping. So you sleep better and faster, I think. So that's pretty nice. So I'll store that by my bed. Uh, and the silk I want to take back. All this crop waste doesn't really belong in here. So I needed a bunch of complex iron parts. Oh wow, look at all this stuff waiting for us. Okay, I'm gonna get this going again. Uh, let's do conical flasks. I'll do a whole bunch. 40. Now I need a complex iron parts. I think I stored those away, so let's go find those. This is all wood. All the wood stuff I was putting down here, I think. I do have a wood chopping zombie. Actually, let's get this guy. Um, come here, you. We're going to put you on here. And you're just going to do flitch for a while. So he should go through the flitch with these logs and then more logs should get delivered. And I need a glass of water. I'll be right back. Speak of the devil. He just came in. I think the thing was full so he didn't really drop anything off. Actually, maybe he dropped off some stone. Oh, weird. I can hear this now. Okay, wooden things. I thought I had a wooden only storage. Anyway, we're gonna jam it in here. Looks good. And... What am I hearing? Weird. I'm hearing this sawing from a weird place. Keep these going. Drop this crap off. That guy's still working away. These are not ready yet, are they? No. Okay, I gotta find my complex iron parts. Simple, there's the complex. 13. Uh, what else did I need? I forget already. Um, a bunch of polished stone, 24 I think. I do have some stored away though. So we got 21 and we'll do a few more here. Wow, that's really loud. Mr. Saw. Now the chisels only last for so long, these iron chisels. Yeah, it just got depleted, so I have to make another one here. Uh, where do I make my chisel? Here, I think. Yeah, iron chisel. I guess I can only make one at the moment. Grab that. Actually, we can store it away. We don't need to carry it. And somehow I got maggots in my inventory. I'm just going to delete them. So many of them. Okay, we'll make some more of these. I think I have enough now. I'm not sure I have enough complex iron parts though. Okay, what day is it? It's snake day. I should probably go talk to him. I, can't, I don't think I have what he needs yet though. Snake, what do you need? Bucket of blood, still bloody nails. Yeah, we haven't gone into the dungeon yet, so forget that. Check out my other quests here. I want to get that fence done. So 24 of those, I think. Complex iron parts. I'm not sure I have enough, so I'll just make some more. No. Oh. Make some more here. Should have got the zombie to do it, but I'll do it. Okay, 
What else did I need? I think that's it. The fancy stone. That should be more than enough. Okay, I'm gonna drink some wine. And I really should go grab my grapes since they're all done before I do this. Because they're all done. And selling wine is really good money, so. Get these going. Now I did these, these are of varying quality, bronze, silver, and some gold. Because when you sell the wine, the price is based on the inventory of that type, so you can sell six of each, I think each week, once the inventory is down to zero, if that makes any sense. The more you sell, the price goes down, so if you, if you let their inventory kind of balance out, then I think you can sell six a week. Something like that. I just got a whole crap load of grapes. And I can't even fit it in my inventory anymore. So we're gonna use this quality fertilizer. And I'm gonna plant, I'll just plant whatever I have in my inventory at the time. Whatever it selects, but not that. Yeah, we're gonna upgrade from using the crappy fertilizer. What can I store away? I'm gonna store all the seeds because I don't need them in my inventory. Wow, I got 50 gold seeds now. I gotta take this crop waste down to the compost. I wish you could build a compost here, but I won't let you. what I really should be focusing on is the gold wine because um, I haven't sold much of that yet in fact I don't think I've sold any of it I'm gonna try to do this fertilizer plus the other fertilizer see if we get like a double bonus here I think we will this part's a little tedious uh, I'll just do regular here Yeah, this could be easier. I think once you get a system going though, you can just hit E twice really quickly. Oh, that was copper, I didn't want that. I should probably segregate these, so like bronze, silver, gold. Uh, which fertilizer did I have there? I can't remember. Yeah, I've got the good stuff there already. So we're gonna do gold seeds. I'll put this in first, and then we'll put this in. Wow, there's a lot to plant here. Lots of scrolling. And mouse work. This game's like carpal tunnel syndrome. Okay, I don't want to plant them all. I should. the kind of stuff I do off camera because it's kind of busy work. There's probably a better way, but I don't know it. Okay. Maybe if I didn't have any of this, it would automatically go to this. That's a thought. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to get rid of all this. So we only have a good fertilizer there and see if that makes it foolproof. Probably not. That guy's still sawing away. <laughs> okay, crop waste. We'll get rid of that. And we'll stick this fertilizer in here. Peat. Those go in there. Crop waste goes in there. That should be good. 
Back we go. Plant the rest. Actually, I'll plant the rest off camera. You guys get the idea. I gotta drop off all the stuff that keeps going in my inventory. Those and those. And we'll get uh, something going on here. Maybe some iron ingots. Wait a minute, what's the difference here? Two, four. Oh, this is because we upgraded. We can do more at a time now. Okay, fair enough. I'll go drop off the grapes. Actually, we can probably just process them here. I'll do some copper. Do all the copper, then all the silver, then all the gold. There's a bug here with the selector. It goes spastic. Okay. Uh, what am I doing? Yeah, silver. And then gold. I think I have some gold ones. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'll we'll sell some gold wine to the merchant next time he's in town. Assuming I have some made. Okay, that's almost all done. I should probably build some more firm ferment barrels, wine making barrels. Okay, we're gonna do gold and gold. Ooh. We're still only 50% chance of getting gold. Even with the wine master perk. Hmm. And the rest store for later. Grapes. How much do we get for this? We get 30 and 60 versus 30 and 50. Hmm. Yeah, I might as well just run this way. We're trying to upgrade that, that fence. Do I have everything I need? Built stone fence, yeah. So we got another 10. Oh, we got an achievement too. So we're at 231. Looks good. Some of these crappy bodies I should just pull out of here. You know what? I'm going to remove this. I should probably go harvest some honey soon. We're running out. Pull that out. And then I got to pull the actual body out. So I need one of these. Zoom. And maybe I can go improve this body. Let's go see. Oh, there's one on the table I gotta get rid of. That one, we're gonna go burn. But this one, if we take the blood and the fat, maybe we can get to a five white skull. Yes. Now apparently taking the bones is neutral. So it doesn't do anything, but we'll try that and hopefully it doesn't affect it. Yeah, so we still got a five. Let me put these body parts away first. Uh, good. Our zombies are idle up there, which I don't like. But we'll get this body packed away. I know it's not a perfect, later on you can get like 12 skull bodies, I think. White skull bodies. But I have to do a bunch of, um, in, uh, what, what's it called? When you put fluids in a body. I forget the name right now. Uh, since this is a six skull and I want to use the good stuff. Put that away. We'll use, oh, this cross is four. We'll use this. And then I'll put a stone thing around it. 
Okay. What to do next? Let's put this wine on our hot bar. Drink a little bit of that. I think I'll go grab some honey. I should probably pick this, take this stone back with me. The flyers, though. We didn't do anything with the uh, the trade office stuff, so I'm going to see what that's all about. Where I build that. Do I build that in here, maybe? Oh, this is all wine stuff. Okay. Maybe we build it out here. I gotta go to this thing. Create factory. I think that's what I want. Oh, there it goes. Okay, cool. That wasn't so bad. Okay, I think all my stone is full. Oh, wow. I gotta get the zombie on the stone. Where's the zombie? Is he behind this? Oh, he was doing wood stuff. We're gonna get him going through the stone. Uh, you can break down stone for us. I love zombies. They're the best. Okay, this factory. That's gonna be a lot of work. Wow. Okay. Oh, we had to dig it out. Now we have to build it. Okay. And we're sleepy, so... Okay, what do we do in here? Holy crap. Okay. Box of goods. Okay. Wow, this is, this is crazy. So we need 40... lentils to make a box. We don't really have enough to do any of this. They only take the really fancy food. Let's just try to make a box of goods, whatever that's going to do. I think maybe it said something about only buying the good vegetables. Okay, that's gone. What did that do? <laughs> box of goods. I have no idea what that did. That took a crap load of nails, though. What the heck? I'm very confused. Oh, I think I sold. Oh, I think I, what did I do there? 75 over four. I think I might've sold complex iron parts there. Cause the actual box takes four flitch, two nails, and then whatever's on the right hand column. Oh, okay, complex iron parts, that's what I sold. I don't know what I sold it for though. So we really need some good vegetable seeds. So I'm gonna have to go visit the farmer and buy some good stuff, some good seeds. I have some, but not very many. This guy's all done. So I'd like to get this guy doing this kind of stuff. Silver lentil, silver pumpkin. Okay, was cop, was bronze, onion a thing I could sell? check. Uh, gold. Uh, silver and gold only. Okay. But well, we can sell other stuff, like complex iron parts. I think I'll go rest. Let's get the marble off here, because we can't do anything with it yet. And put the stone on there. Store some stuff away. Oh, these maggots. Didn't want them. <laughs> Back down we go. Maggots and peat. And we really need to sleep. Are these ready? Oh, these are ready. <laughs> Sorry. 
lost track of easily. Okay, uh, what should I do? I'm gonna save those seeds for something else. Just, we'll start just stockpiling all that. And we'll get him to make... No, 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 stay inside. While we're waiting, we'll get him to make more wheat. Oh, it's almost parody again. That went fast. Okay, I'm gonna sleep the whole night here. I do want to invest in or advance all the quest lines, but I also want to just take my time learning all the game mechanics and stuff. What do we have in here? Just about everything. <laughs> Okay, there's a furnace three I wanted to do. That requires pigskin, paper, complex iron parts, stone. This one's almost done, so I might be able to just upgrade this one. Oh, that doesn't belong there. Stone belongs over here. And you, sir, can do more stone. Check our technology here. I got 51 points. Maybe I want to do uh, jeweler would be cool. What else do we have? Scent of gold. Get precious metals more often. Oh, circular saw. I need these two things to do some more advanced stuff. So circular saw. Let's do that and. Assembly stand. I'll do these two. Wow, our, our yard is going to get pretty full here. Okay. Assembly. Oh, circular, circular saw. That could fit right there. That's kind of cramped. Maybe I'll put it under here. Yeah, we'll do that. And what was the other thing? Carpenter's Workbench 2. Do I even have a Carpenter's Workbench? I think so. Yeah. What was the other one? The stand. Where did that thing go? I could have sworn there was a thing called a... Let me check my technology here. Assembly stand. Oh, that's Carpenter's Workbench 2. Okay. That's this thing. Let's try to upgrade that. Oh, we need wooden beams. Okay, that can be made over here once we get it going. Just burning through the technology. Okay, what can we make here? Wooden beams, yay! Logs and complex iron parts, okay. I'm gonna make four of those. Actually, that's 12. <laughs> I wonder if we get blue points for this. Uh, no, all red. Wow, we're powered by electricity, maybe, somehow? <laughs> There's probably a zombie running on a wheel underneath the ground there. Okay, yeah, that's awesome. So that, what did that use again? Logs and complex iron parts. That's wonderful. And we can also make Glitching stuff here. 10 energy. Can we put a zombie on here? Oh my. So powerful. And we can do planks directly. Oh, we don't even need to go through flitch anymore. What a wonderful world. Okay, we'll get him to make some more beams. I'll finish this off. Oh, I found, I found an exploit. You can get the zombie to do most of the work, and then finish it off and get the points. It's probably not an exploit, but you know what I mean. I'll make a few of these, because I need these. Some delicious wine. I wonder if you can get drunk in this game. Probably. If you drink too much. OK, 
Okay. Um, let's upgrade this thing. Upgrade to furnace three. Ooh, we're getting we're moving up in the world here. What will this thing look like? As we drink ourselves to oblivion. Okay, it looks similar. But we actually need to add some coal here. So we'll do that. Okay, I can make steel parts out of steel, ingot, and ceramic bowls. How odd. Let's make one of those. Oh, we can't. We gotta let it wait. Put those away. What other wonderful things can we do here? I think I built everything I can build. So do I need this thing anymore? I don't think I do. Can I do wooden markers? I don't need, I don't need wooden markers anymore. I could probably knock that thing down. Yeah, sawhorse. We don't need we don't need this thing anymore, so I might destroy it. But what else can I do? What else can I do? Um, anvil two, furnace three. We've done all that. Circular saw. Paper press. I don't think I've made a paper press. Or have I? Is that what I've built two of already? Is that this thing? Paper press. Yeah, I already have those. I thought I had printing press though. A simple printing press. Where do we build that? Maybe down in the church? Was it on this list? Uh, no. Printing press. Oh, it's prayer day again. Let's go over to the church. Put this wine away. Uh, we'll put ten away. If I grab some extra crap I don't need, but... Whoa, what's all this? Is all this. Okay, this is... What the heck? Items to transport. Hmm. Okay, I think this is where the goods come down on the little elevator. And I think I might need a zombie here to take the goods from here all the way over here. Yeah, I need a zombie in there. Pretty sure that's how it works. And then he'll take it up here and stick it. Wait a minute, what do we have? Do I have gold already? Trade report. No dice, okay. We'll put this on here. And then next day, it'll work. But we have our flyers, let's do a marketing campaign. Our fame went up. So if we had flitch, we could make another pallet. This is cool. Very cool. So I need to make another zombie. I've got 11 faith on me. And it's a church service, so... Yeah, let's make another zombie. I want to make a good one, though. But this episode's getting way too long. Uh, so... We'll do our final... Final church service here after I approve the graveyard. Just a little bit more. We want to max maximize everything. This one's pretty good. This would be a good zombie, actually. Hmm. I think uh, we'll deal with him later. What about this one? Oh, this would... See, the red skulls don't matter for the zombies, so... I think we'll dig him up later. What about this one here? We're already at four. Oh yeah, that'll work. Okay. Let's do our final sermon of the episode. I won't use candles this time. I'll save them for when the church is even better. 
I don't have my sermon on me because I was trying to be good with my inventory. I do have silk on me though. I probably I'm probably missing some parts here. Oh, I need to make jointing for these nice benches, so we'll do that next episode. I wanted to make the other upgraded version of the sermon. The combo prayer, like the silver version. This is the bronze version. It requires a minimum 15 church rating. The next one up requires 30, I think, to get a 100% chance. And I think we're, yeah, we're at 37, so that we could go with the silver version and we're gonna get way more money if we do that. But I'll make that off camera, I think, and then next time we'll see what it's all about. The faith and the money's coming in pretty good now, though. Very nice. We didn't get 13 because I didn't use the candles, but that's fine. And I've got the hiccups. Okay, we'll grab the loot here. Pretty good. How much money do we have now? Oh, because I bought the trade license. We're, we're poor again. But, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> uh... Hope you enjoyed that episode. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.